Hey everyone, welcome back to my garden and I wanted to show an update today. It's been a little while since I showed you the ground cherry plant over here and as you see this plant it has grown in quite a bit. Let's actually zoom back, you can see just how big this plant is. It's pretty much completely filled in the space that I had for it to grow and I even lifted up the lights so about an extra six inches or so and it's already as you see kind of outgrowing that space it's shooting out branches every single place as you see and all these side branches are just really making this thing a very very bushy plant for this small space right here but because of that it's actually putting on all of these beautiful lanterns just about every single place you look you see lanterns everywhere look how beautiful it looks and i've actually just been waiting for things to ripen up and fall off i've yet to gather anything after my initial first harvest those four tiny little ground cherries and two of which actually um, bolted away and started to rot for some reason they just stayed green and those were the two that were deformed and the other two that actually grew in were very very sweet and delicious uh sorry i wasn't able to actually record that video i'll be doing a tasting once i actually harvest the second the second round off of this plant and sure enough exactly what i thought would happen i would have a ton of ground cherries and thankfully that's exactly what's happened let's actually look at a few different angles and you'll see a whole ton of beautiful beautiful lanterns everywhere i apologize for the noise in the background let's actually look at what the root system looks like let's pop this open and look at that nice beautiful healthy looking root system and the water level looks nice and good, about a, approximately about a gallon left in there. I noticed actually that the air pump, the air stone, fused into the root system here, so that's pretty much all one thing there now, which I'm sure the plant is loving, all that added oxygen boost that it's getting. And I actually keep the air pump running on the same schedule as my light system i keep it running for 14 hours on and 10 hours off every day so that's the same thing for the air pump as soon as the lights turn off my air pump turns off so in the middle of the night it's just a kratky system and during the day it's a deep water culture system so i'm pretty much utilizing kind of a two-in-one system and overall the crat i'm really excited for the amount of growth and this thing has been putting on it's really a self-growing plant i really have not had to do much at all besides really just let this thing keep growing and soon enough i'll be harvesting these these ground cherries and hopefully we'll be making like a some type of preserve or jam with it and i'll be showing you how to do that also as well as collecting seeds and making those available for anybody interested in growing this plant well, that will be available for purchase also so hopefully you like the episode and you get to see what's going on with the ground cherry i'm sure a lot of you are watching these episodes and following along if you have any questions post them down below and hope, don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe thanks for watching